My son Ben died when he was nearly three years old in 2002. My whole world fell apart after that. I, I was experiencing a grief that I honestly didn't think I could survive and my family was really, really in desperate need of support. And fortunately, we were surrounded by amazing people who came in and offered us kindness in amazing, amazing ways. And I realized that the kindness that people were offering us was uh, not taking away the sadness, not taking away the pain, but was holding us, holding us while we felt the sadness and the pain that we needed to feel. And what I learned from my experience is that kindness is powerful and strong and vital. So Ben's Bells is the way that we came up with to honor Ben and his life. And the bells are beautiful and the pieces of them are made by the community. Uh, now the bells are even more special because they're not for sale, but what we do is hang them randomly in public places for people just to find. So you might be you know, out walking your dog or playing basketball in the park or you know, grocery shopping. If you find one, it has a tag that says, you have found a Ben's Bell, take it home and remember to spread kindness. And it's a very, very simple concept, uh, but what we found is it's incredibly powerful. The people who have found bells have shared stories about what the bell means to them. And that's what Ben's Bells is about. It's about celebrating, um, honoring, and recognizing the importance of the practice of kindness. There are many ways to get involved with Ben's Bells. Uh, one way is to come to our studios and actually work with the clay or work with the glazes to help create the pieces for Ben's Bells. And we have two public studios in Tucson that are open five days a week where anybody can come down and there's no artistic ability necessary for that. We have an incredible mural program where we create large scale mosaic murals with community input and community hands. So we travel throughout the community presenting to uh, thousands and thousands of school kids. Uh, we present in business places, in the prison system. Uh, you may get involved with our kindness education programs. The kindness education programs are offered to schools at no cost. Um, they're a year-round program that infuses the practice of kindness into every day, into everyday activities. Um, it is not a curriculum-based program, so it in no way takes away from the core standards, but, in, but it actually enriches the environment by helping to create a, a kinder climate on the school campus. The same sort of educational programming, programming is also available for workplaces through our Kind Colleagues programs and also just throughout neighborhoods through our Kind Neighbors program. The idea being that if all of us at all different levels of our community are tied into this practice, that we can all reinforce and support each other in the practice and we'll see real significant change out of it.